Hey, hey, everyone. What's going on with you? Long time no hear from or see. Yep, yep, it's Mad Cat. I'm back. Thank y'all for sticking with the channel. Um, just a quick overview. My last month has been quite crazy. Um, I had to go do, um, uh, let's see, how can I say this? I had a bunch of medical procedures done last month um, that I had to take care of. Um, and so I had to step away from the channel and creating content to get all that done. Um, not going to really go into all the things that I had to have done, but just know your boy is highly favored and blessed. So with that, I figured, hey, why not come back to the channel, ripping and roaring, ready to make some new content. And so I decided since No Man's Sky has dropped their update pack, I was like, you know what? Let's check it out. It's supposed to have new worlds and visuals and new animals and pretty much everything. Hello Studios has been an excellent dev group to uh, play. Why not step into No Man's Sky, check out the new update. Um, I'm going to start a brand new save. So that way we can hit the ground, just fresh start up and running and we'll just go through it as we go through it. So with that being said, Let's hop into it. I'm not going to do anything too crazy. I'm just going to step in and do normal mode for right now. See how I do. If later on, you know, we see some things, I see some things that I want to do with change. I know I have no problem resetting and going and customizing the game for the playthrough. But for right now, we're just going to hit the normal mode, sit back, relax, get some popcorn and hang out with your boy Mad Cat. So let's go. And while this is going on, I just want to say, hey, once again, thank y'all for sticking with the channel. Like I said, this last month has been crazy. Medically, like I said, I had to step away, but you know, I'm not opposed to making a video, going in a little bit more detail. If, if enough of y'all really want to know what happened, what medical things I've, I've been going through and continue to go through, but you know, that's up to y'all. You know, either way, you know, I don't have a problem with sharing that information to y'all because hey, I figured like this, if y'all gonna stick with the channel, you know, I owe an explanation to the subscribers, people that, my day ones that have been down with me since then. But let's begin. Let's go. Commencing assistance Ah, uh, we're on a cold, cold planet. Geokinetic system online. All right. Now, as we getting started, I'll probably just skip through a lot of the basics, uh, cut away because I, I believe most of y'all have already seen, you know, the beginning stages of this game. Um, so a lot of this early content is going to be monotonous to y'all, but I'll keep enough in for those who haven't experienced No Man's Sky and then experiencing it for the first time. So I'll keep enough, you know, early, early, you know, content in for them. But for the most of it, I'll be skipping around early on until we get into some. All right, so let's go. Jesus, we're already cold. All right. I need to get my scanner up. All right. 
get some of this stuff going. Got no caves around here. Alright. Hit the tab button. Let's get this fixed up real quick. There we go. Alright. So we need to search for some sodium. Where is some? Way up there? Man. Oh, here we go. Let's go. one at I know there was another one up here yeah oh uh, it's up there I, can I get that of course I can I got a jet pack grab all of this All right, got enough sodium. Let's go ahead, tear that, here we go. All right, so I need to get back down. I'm trying to do that carefully. Knew that was gonna hurt. Get some more ferrite dust while we're on the move here. One thing I want to do here is basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. Where's my multi tool? Um, what I want to do is. Get this advisor. What do I yeah, I need uh nanocarbon. Okay. But I want to get that up and going. Let's see that while I'm here. Yeah, I need carbon carbon. So I need to be on the lookout for some carbon. Uh, that's right over there. That ain't too bad. Alright, let's go. Need this dehy dehydrate. Well, dehydrate. Yeah, the blue crystals. I'm just gonna say that. So, just want to ask, you know, what y'all been doing since I've been gone? We last left off. Have y'all been enjoying the new update? I'm coming to get you. What do y'all think of the update? Did Hello Studios knock this out the park? I mean, it's kind of, you know, for those of us who haven't really been keeping up with No Man's Sky, this kind of came out the blue. And, you know, for it to be, you know, free, because, you know, I know some developer studios that would actually charge you for and, you know, make this a DLC. So for them just to give the community this type of update for free, hey, I cannot complain. All I can say kudos and well done to y'all. Oh, I need, uh, I'm out. I need some more carbon. Right here, I should be able to get it from this. That's oxygen. I need that anyway. Is this? Our navigation data?
Okay. Excel suit upgrade chart. Really? Okay. Well, we definitely will be getting that. And then over there. I didn't mess around. Let's get over there. Carbon. I may not be able to get this. Dense carbon. Dang it, dang it, man. Yeah. Let's see here. Way over there. Wow. Okay. Let's get over there while we can. What is that? You know what? We got a lot to discover. These new creatures. Is it up there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, let's go. it for right now because it's still early on thermal protection yes I will take that oh hey, yeah I'm going over there right now I am heading that direction Gonna get over there. I will put that on here in a second. I just want to get over here to where that building was. Ah, 
came over here for nothing. There's no damage equipment or nothing over here. Wow. There's a beacon over there. All right, here we go. What's over here? Search that. Got the oxygen. Okay. Got a little lawn chair out here. Reinforced door. Okay, so this is probably guarded by. <laughs> yeah, we'll be all right. We'll be all right. Go over here and mark this real quick. Save this. Some nanites out of it. Cool, cool. Let's take that for right now because I can always grind that up. There we go. Got the carbon we needed. So it really wasn't a total bus coming over here. Got some oxygen. All right. Let me go ahead and fill up my thermal protection. Technology All right, let's recharge. Technology recharge. All right, let's go. Now let's get back to where we needed to be, which was trying to find our spacecraft which I didn't mess around and lost where we were supposed to go. Now I got to find it manually. Let's see here. Yeah, yeah. Damn sure about to get some more carbon. Let's go, let's go. Get some more sodium while I'm at it. That over there. Get some more ferrite dust. Early on, definitely need that. All right, what do we got? Damaged machinery. Again, I'm gonna take that right now, early on. But as we get more into the game, I won't be picking this up. Pick up this ferrite dust. up all this stuff got a little box over here grab that what are we gonna get more carbon yes sir Okay. Grab this real quick. We're gonna slide over here. 
grab this. Sodium. Ooh. We'll take this oxygen from you, sir. I need that. All right, so what I need to do here is I need to get my scanner up. So what I'm going to do is, you know what? Let's install this right now. Yeah, there we go. And I'm not going to mess with this yet. But what I am going to do is get this and over here to the multi-tool. Boom. Now I got my visor up. Yes. Now we're cooking with gas. This over here. Very technology. I can't get to it anyway. Damage machinery. Very technology. Cross work. Buried catch, unknown building, unknown building, sodium deposit, ship is over there. So we're going to tag that. So we know copper deposits. Yes. I'm going to scan this, make a few credits. Cargo drop, Sentinels up there. there. Yeah. All right, let's get over here to the ship and let's advance the story some. See you when I get over there, folks. All right, we finally made it over here to the ship location. Hey, buddy, what are you? All right. What are you up here? I am curious. Now, you don't have to take my advice, but what I would do if I was you is as soon as you can get your visor repair. So therefore you can scan everything so you will know what it is that you're mining. And on top of that, you know, you can get some, um, little bit, little bit of cash. Now we're going to get this. Oh, so now, And we do have a little cave over here by the, our ship. So I know the ship is right there. We're not gonna go over there right yet. I'm just gonna do a little bit of, uh, as you would say, farming. Get some of this stuff up. All right, weapon depleted, no big deal. There we go. Fully recharged, we're gonna mine some carbon and everything around here for a little bit. For half a second. What is this? More carbon, cool. So what I'm going to do now you you won't see this in, in its entirety, but I'm about to just clear out this cave to the best of my ability. All right, so 
I didn't sat here and I ain't been in here farming this cave out. As you can see, my cargo is pretty thick. Look how much carbon I got out of here. I mean, I've got a little bit of uh, silver, tritium, cobalt. I mean, I've been in here just grinding, going away, trying to get, you know, as much as I could. Um, so I'm content with what I got. We're going to get down here now and go ahead and get the ship started and progress the story mode here. Gonna go over here. We're not gonna touch the big red ball right yet. We're gonna go over here first. Grab this damaged machine. Um, I'm not gonna grab that right now. I don't need that. I mean, because basically I could just refine that into getting nanites, which hell. And the nanites I got just from right there is probably the amount that I would have gotten just for taking time to refine that down into nanites. Now, I didn't show it, but I will show it because I do have some of my cargo. You can refine that down all the way and get nanites out of it. Um, so, this here I'm going to grab because you can make ferrous dust like I stated earlier out of that. And I'll show that here soon as I get a refiner down. All right, let's go over here to the ship and progress story. Do -do 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 -do. Atlas connection, launch thrusters offline, pulse engine offline, find myself alone in a strange world, unequipped and in danger. I have no I, no memory of how I got here, no sense of before. But this ship at least seemed to recognize me. The controls react to my touch, or at least that of my exosuit. I'm not dead yet. This ship is my lifeline out to the stars. I'm not gonna read the log. What I'm gonna do is connect my exosuit. Do, do, do unavailable log substituting data exosuit connected suggestions pilot should perform maintenance selection the desired repair path yes repair systems self-guided repair protocol initiated and there you go folks pulse engines we need to get that make metal plating and a hermetic seal unfortunately we won't be able to do that. As far as a hermetic seal, we'll have to go and actually, um, but what I am gonna do is a metal plating right now, and I'm not gonna do it for thrusters right now. What I wanna do right now is I wanna get my um, portable refiner up. So I'm gonna do that. Drop that there. All right, let's get some stuff on the go. Fuel source, I can take carbon or condensed carbon. Um, since I have so much carbon, I'm gonna use that and I will eventually get some more condensed carbon. But right now, go here. And like I showed you, I'm gonna make some ferrous dust right now. So I'm gonna take this rusted metal, I got 330 of it, and put that in there and begin the process. And that's gonna do that. That's floated in the air. Little graphical glitch. I... Yeah, see it's not worth it. So I'm gonna go over here to the red ball and hit this, interact with it, boom. Scenario iteration, deleted boundary separation failure, likely. Vessel 16, empty cause, central intervention, deliberate transfer. Broadcast. Broadcast is received. Traveler anomaly detected. Anomaly is compliant. Position logged. 
systems integrity scan initialized. All right. So we're going to go back over here. This still going. Yep. All right. Get back in here real quick. Now I do need to make another metal plate. So I'm going to do that right now. All right, done that. Starship, go to thrusters. Get the metal plate, put that in there. I'll need the um, hermetic seal. First, let's go ahead and let the story progress. Yep. Quest assistance, of course. It's going to... Uh, I had to go over here and talk to the red ball again. And then from there, it's going to send me a location to where I can find a hermetic seal in a nearby uh, building. Yeah, got it. But right now, what I want to do is I need pure ferrite, which I don't have. And what I'm going to do is hermetic seal. I need not a hermetic seal. The hydrant jelly. So let's grab this, make that since I have it. And come out of this. Should be done. How much? Man, it's taking a minute. As you see, this is why I picked it up all this rusted metal early on, uh, is because I wanted to turn it into ferrite. And then once I get that all into ferrite, I'm gonna turn around, recycle it again, so it can be re, I mean, refined into pure ferrite. So, got a little bit over 10 seconds. We're down to 33. That is crazy how much fuel it took. But we're done. Let's bring that, run it back through again. And as you see, pure ferrite. And there we go. Let's walk around and see what we can grab here. We get some oxygen and ferrite dust since I'm waiting on this. Come here. Like I said, scan everything. Because as you can see, got a little bit of credits. What are you up here? I got you already. What is this? It's wheat. All right, so, really, grab all this real quick. It's just ferrite dust and oxygen. Let me get over here um, because I want to make sure that I'm not, yeah, see, I'm already down. Can I make it? Boom! Here, ferrite dust. All right, I need to put some more fuel in here. Oh, so, uh, yeah. So now, what I want to do is, I want to let's see here. How much carbon? I got a lot of carbon. So I'm going to process some of this carbon into condensed carbon. All right. So what do I need? Go ahead, our ship. Your ferrite, do that. And thruster, 
Here we go. So now we got our thruster, boss thrusters prepared. Now I could have, you know, dismantled this and got some copper, which I am going to do. Let me show you. I will need copper as we go along here. So right now, I'm gonna dismantle this. Boom, 100 copper, just like this. Just a little tip for y'all. Just a little, little tip. Hermetic seal. Need to go and get that. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and let this uh, roll. How much dirt over this do I have? I'm not going to do all of this. Nowhere near. I just want to get about 500, which, and I'm going to stop it. And then we're going to progress the story. There we go. We're getting there, getting there. All right. And boom. Stop it. And I'm going to put this in the exosuit. Put this. Do I really? Yeah. I'm going to put this in the starship. All right. We're going to get out of that. Pick this up. We're going to go back over here to the ball. Talk to it once again. It's going to give us a location. Take planetary chart. Just like that. Open up my inventory. Exosuit cargo right here. Use that. Where is it? I didn't see it. Way up there, huh? How far is that? 900. Wow. All right. Got a little trek. But right now, before we set off, I'm going to go ahead and get my thermal protection up. I sit in here real quick, and then we're gonna head off and grab it. Coming up pretty quick. All right, let's hop out and let's go. Try to get there as fast as possible. Because when I get halfway to the spot, I know I didn't scan you, sir. Yes, I did. It's gonna spawn a storm. And so I wanna be close because the storm is going to get wicked real quick. Oh. We're gonna get there and let's go, let's go, let's go. Yep, here it comes. And it's about to get extremely cold. If you thought negative 71, well, negative 72 is it's bad. It's about to get bad, bad. So. We need to get there quickly. Ah, come on. Look, 120. It's, it's, it's happening, folks. Yes, yes, yes. As you can see, my thermal protection is dropping. Dropping quickly. But never fret, we should make it. Yeah. 
Yeah, we're almost there. We're almost there. I see you. Now about to grab me. Oh, oh, didn't see that drop. We're gonna get in here. Woo! Let's thaw out a little bit first. Get some first aid. There we go. Let's thaw out a little bit. There we go. Pick up the hollow archives. Yes. No one else. Make this recording in case. <laughs> Leave it behind because in fabricator because it might be of some use. Visor damaged. Can't find ship. Recover the supplies. And there it is, our hermetic seal that we need to repair our ship. As soon as we do that, guess what? Storm is clear. We're good to go. Now. Oh, as you can see, we have our hermetic seal and the ability to make it now. So we're good to go. Let's head back out. Let's go search this other building over here. Or y'all. Like I said, see that 1,600 units just by scanning. So that's why I said, yeah, that's what do you think I've been doing? Acid this fauna, it says locate ship right there. All right, I located my ship. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, let's get in here. Search this other building real quick. I hope y'all enjoying this fresh start playthrough. I know I am. Picked up a research specimen. Got an encrypted navigation data cube. Pick that up. Got a little bit of nanites, not much compared to what we will be getting in the future. Nah, I ain't got time to be sitting in the chair, my guy. And so what we're gonna do is we're going to head back out and get to our ship, get this installed in our ship and we're going to take off. So, let's go. I'm gonna make sure I can. Y'all look fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. We're gonna ride. Let's go. Once again, you know, I just want to say thanks to everyone for sticking with the channel while I was uh, down taking care of some personal issues. Um, like I said, if you're liking the content, go ahead and hit the like button. Let YouTube know if you want to see more of this content from me. It'd be much appreciated. And while you're at it, hey, look, don't cost you a thing, but it would really mean the world to me if you go ahead and subscribe to the channel as I continue to try to build this community into something special. I've never asked anything of you that I wouldn't do for myself. So, with that in mind, if you wouldn't mind, go ahead and smash the like button, run the likes up on this video, and hit the like button. I mean, not hit the like button, also subscribe to the channel. Let's get over here to the crash site and let's take off. Wait a minute. Is this what I think this is? Oh! 
Look at all that carbon down there. But I ain't stopping for that. I'm looking at this. Ah. Uh -huh. Let's see. Can I make like No. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Man. Anyway, I'll come back and grab it. That's a long way down. We're gonna go over here. Let's go. As you can see, we're just over there. Not too far of a run. Just need to get down off this mountain a little bit. Grab this while we're here. More carbon. Now I don't need the rusted metal since I've already showed y'all that that can turn into ferrite dust. But I will pick up all these red canisters. All right, let's go. plant let's take a moment just to look at this look at this landscape beautiful just beautiful all right go gotta get back Now, I could kill them and get you know some meat and eat, but I'm not really messing with them right now. I'm really just trying to get up off this planet right now, get to the stars. Got enough sodium, got enough ferrite dust right now. Yeah, we're, we're going to make it. I'm not going to stop right now. And now what we're going to do is install this hermetic seal. Like so. And just like that, we're good to go. Pulse engines have now been repaired. It's the tritium, pyrite, but we don't have any of that, but we do have the tritium. This is why in that cave, I was basically mining all that I could to get that, because I knew I was gonna need it for this. Now, as far as the launch thrusters, I can either use uranium or launch fuel. Um, I'll show you that a little bit later, but right now, how about this? Let's get to the stars. Yeah. Let's take off, Shep. Whoa! Let's hit the thrusters, let's hit the gas, get to space. Just like that, we're in the stars, people. Now, Now it's gonna ask us to basically test our ship controls as far as our thrusters. So let's test the boost. Here we go. Now let's test the pulse engines. Let them charge up. Let it go. Here we go. And we're gonna come out of that boom. There it is. Now we have communication that we need to answer. answer the communication please identify yourself a mad cat just identify ourselves you're not alone followed 
The broadcast ends as strangely as it begins. The final piece of the signal appears to be a set of planetary coordinates. Input the coordinates. Yes. Do that. Alert. Navigation data received. Thank you. And it's at this planet, but I'm not gonna go there right this second. I wanna look around while we have the chance. Now we can shoot these and blow this up and get more tritium, which I would highly recommend doing is because you need that for your space fuel. Let's see, let's do a scan. We know that's a frozen planet because we just came from there. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to pulse over here to this other planet and do a scan. So let's go. Unknown. There's some more over here. Might have that. Immediately hit a scan. Now. You have a choice. You could basically go straight to and do the quest, or what I would do is hit up this asteroid field over here and just do a little makeshift mining. And what you want to do is pick out strange look looking formations. Get over here to it. I mean, I know I'm kidding. There we go. What did I get? Gold. Silver. And this will help with your, uh, getting money early on because you can actually sell this stuff when we get to the space station. So that's what I would do is basically just sit through here and take it, not take your time, you know what I'm saying, but just shoot up some stuff so you can basically mine some silver, gold, tritium, like this formation here. It's crazy. Or you don't have to. You can just basically go straight to what the story wants you to do. At this point, you know, you can progress the story how you want. Slow it down, Mad Cat. Slow it down. Got some platinum out of that. More platinum. Silver. Platinum. All right. So I'm just really just showing y'all what y'all could do um, when you first leave the planet. You don't have to actually go directly and do it, do the story as they want you to do. is hitting me. Oh, I need to get up out of here. Oh, really? I'm about to get up out of here. I ain't got time to be fighting, bro. You're going to have it.
trying to get away. Here we go. I'm not trying to do space combat right now. I'm up out of that. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back and I'm going to actually look at some of these planets. And then eventually what I'm going to do is land, find a space station before the game actually uh, tells me about it because they want you to do the quest first. But I'm actually not going, I'm going to go ahead and find space station first because it's going, it, the reason why I do it, I'm going to show you eventually, but not right this second. You'll understand why in a, in a, uh, when I get to that. Go ahead and this planet, Paradise Planet. That's going to, I will be coming back to that. But not right this second. So over here. Did I map this one yet? No, I did not. Let's get over there. Is this a planet or is this actually a moon? We'll, we'll see here shortly. I'm not actually going to land, I'm just going to scan it. I'm going to scan this one little planet. See what kind it is, if it's a moon or a planet. And then I'm going to go ahead and um, head to the space station. We're not close enough yet? Scanning? we were close now. We gotta be close now. Okay, we're not? There we go. I'm up out of that contaminated plant planet. Now that we know. Alright. So now I'm going to actually head to the space station and um land there. So I see you when I get there, folks. All right, people, we're coming up onto our space station. Now you're probably wondering, hey, Mancat, how do you find your first space station if it's not marked and the game wants you to do another quest before that? Well, I'll let you know. See right here where all these lines are all coming together and they're all coming to a single point? Usually, just usually, that once we're, that's where you'll find the space station is where all these points converge into one place. Now, it might take you some time to find it, but when you find all the points converging into this one spot, usually that's your space station. So, just a little tip if you didn't know and you wanted to know and you wanted to do what I, I'm doing is before I actually go do the, the quest that they want me to do, I'm gonna go ahead and land on the space station. first. So let's get there.
impulse drive there. peaceful. I'm just really taking my time soaking all this in. It's the entrance at? This the entrance over here? find the entrance to this particular space station. Definitely don't think it's this one. There it is. Get on in here. Boom, mm, just like that, we have arrived. Let's hop out. All right, people, we made it to the space station. We're gonna end the video right here. Hey, stay tuned for the next video where we're exploring the space station a little bit and further the actual quest, the game quest that they want us to uh, do. So stay tuned for the next video. Hey, this Mad Cat. It's been a blast hanging out with y'all. Hey, just remember, like the video. Please like the video. If this is something that you can get into, and let YouTube know that you enjoy this type of content from me. And until the next video, I hope each and every last one of y'all stay blessed. Y'all have a nice day. I'll holla at y'all. Y'all have a good one, everybody.